and in the far future, the night sky will become even darker for distant civilizations, hiding most evidence of the broader cosmos from them. So the darkness we see now is not just an absence of light. It is a fossil record of a universe that had a hot, dense beginning and has been thinning and stretching ever since. The real answer is that the night sky is dark because the universe is not eternal and unchanging, filled uniformly with stars. Its finite age limits how far light has had time to travel, so we only see a bounded region. The extreme emptiness of space means most directions do not point directly at a star, and the expansion of space redshifts much of the ancient light into wavelengths our eyes cannot detect. What looks like an obvious, everyday fact, that the sky is mostly black, is actually a precise clue that the universe had a beginning in time and has been dynamically evolving ever since. So when you step outside at night and see those few scattered stars against a vast darkness, you're not looking at an empty void. You're reading a long, physical argument about the structure and history of the cosmos, written in light and absence of light. 